Well, Sunday is about the game, of course. But maybe just importantly, the food you stuff in your face. Oh, it is just as important, okay? Well, maybe the commercials, too, are important. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's the food. When the Eagles aren't in it, or our favorite team isn't in it, it's about the food, right? That's so true. Come on, keep going, keep going. So, oh, there's Bubba. I remember when you played, actually. I'm that old. <laughs> this was taken from a Facebook page, 19, uh, people sat on your Facebook page, but the picture is from 1989? Yeah. Okay. And now, you are cooking in the kitchen. Yes. And that got you a new audience and also some money on Shark Tank. <laughs> we are the only people that have removed the bones from an actual slab of ribs, leaving the meat intact so that everyone can enjoy ribs with a knife and fork. Al... Bubba Baker is on Good Day Philadelphia. <laughs> hey, Good to see you, my man. Hey, Mike, how you doing? Good morning. Oh, yeah, uh, come on up. Yes. I love this because my parents, they love ribs, but yes. for me, I don't like the idea of well, you eat these with a knife and bone. fork. You don't have to worry about that. That's what a whole great idea. idea here. You eat them with a knife and fork. So congratulations on Shark Tank because it's not easy to get anything by those folks. Yes. Well, right? we got a great partner in Damon John. And he's the first person to nationally believe in what we're doing because prior to Damon, all we ever heard was, why would I want a rib with the bones removed? And now all these people are jumping on the boat going, mm -hmm. well, that's a great idea. I agree with Alex. Because yes. you don't want to stuff yeah. in your teeth. No. Yeah. Not... Well, how about going out on a date, your first date, and you're with a girl, and she picks up a rib and goes, that's scary. <laughs> it's not attractive. You won't get a second date. Yeah, yeah. But let's see what it, so the ones down on the platter down here, yeah. are they already deboned? These, these are deboned. That's what a rib looks like. Here, let me give you a fork. Okay. There you go. You're about you to eat them. You don't fork. have to give them. Now they're fork tender. You just listen. Let me show you a little trick. They're so tender you don't need a knife. You oh just my god! Fork tender there. What's the key? To this? If I tell you, I gotta kill you. Okay. So, but how a, do you cook it? Because you showed me the package yeah. here. <laughs> it's a secret. <laughs> So, no. Is it smoked? It starts out. So yes, this is what smoked. it comes out. Starts out like this, Mike. Yeah. It starts out with a with bone in. Okay. We season it. We smoke it, and then we passionately remove the bones by hand. But let me show you guys a great thing that happens. So while it's in the package, okay. See where the bones were. Oh, I see. The, the hump. sauce goes in the holes Ooh. and it marinates from the inside out. But once I pick it up, this package in the grocery store, what do I have to do? Oh, you, you have to do. Oven, a well, grill? well, you you first you remove the ribs from the package, okay. okay? And then what you do is you put them in the microwave for a minute 45. George Foreman, you can bake them, mm -hmm. or you can take them outside and grill them. They literally are heat and eat. Wow. There's no five six hour process here, and the goo's already on them. And the, and the yeah. sauce. That's our, <laughs> the goo, mild, really? <laughs> that's our mild southern sauce. This guy. It's a little sweet and tangy, but let me show you what you can do with a debone rib. Okay. First of all, being here in Philly, this is a debone Philly cheese steak, and I'm going to add a little wit whiz to it. Okay. Oh, wit yeah, or without. Let's, let's there wit you go. Here's a macaroni and cheese oh, that, that is, Mike like already that showed. Cheese. Try that mac and cheese. Oh, mm. with the deboned. Yeah, yeah this, oh, now this, I like it like that. That's how I like this it. This is decadent. <laughs> now, here's the thing for the big game. Oh, yeah. That's crazy.